Hi all, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will have a look on how to reduce the fraction to its lowest form. So let's get started. Basically, there are two points to remember while we are reducing the fraction to its lowest form. Let us see those two points with the examples. Here we have the example 32 by 20. Here what we have to do is we have to select the common factor which divides the numerator and denominator. Here we can select the factor 2. Why? Because 2 divides 32 as well as 20. So let's divide. 32 divided by 2 by 20 divided by 2. And write the quotients here. 32 divided by 2. What is the quotient? 60 by 20 divided by 2. What is the quotient? 10. Now go to point number 2. Repeat this till we get 1 as the common factor for numerator and denominator. See, 1 is the not common factor for 16 and 10 here. So again we have to, we can select number 2. Why? Because 2 divides 16 and 2 divides 10. And write the quotients here. 8 by 5. Now you observe here only 1 is the common factor for 8 and 5. So 8 by 5 is the lowest form for the fraction 32 by 20. Okay, let us go to another example. Here we have the fraction 8 by 24. Here we can select the factor 4. Why? Because 4 divides 8 as well as 24. So let's divide. 8 divided by 4 by 24 divided by 24. 4. Write the quotients here. 2 by 6. Again we can select the number 2. Why? Because 2 divides 2 as well as 6. Okay. Write the quotients here. 1 by 3. So 1 by 3 is the lowest form of the fraction 8 by 24. Let us go to another example. 10 by 60. Here we can select the factor 10. Why? Because 10 divides 10 as well as 10 divides 60. So the answer is 1 by 6. Okay, let us go to another example. 44 by 45. You observe that here 1 is the only factor which is common for 44 and 45. So the answer becomes 44 by 45. Why? Because there is no other common factor for 44 and 45. Okay, let us go to last example, 27 by 81. Here we can select the factor 9. Why? Because 9 divides 27 as well as 81. So, write the quotients here. 3 by 9. Again, we can select the factor 3. 3 divides 3 as well as 3 divides 9. So, the answer is 1 by 3. Like this. We have to reduce the fraction to its lowest form. I hope this video is very helpful for you. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe. And don't forget to click on the bell icon. Thank you.